You've likely heard of the war in Syria, but what if there is a war going on that is just as deadly that you rarely hear about? Well, there is, and it's in South Sudan. Times writer Nicholas Kristof has been through some of the areas most affected by fighting and said it seems as many civilians are dying in the war here in South Sudan as in Syria. Over 50,000 people have been killed in the past two years in South Sudan, and 2.4 million have been forced to flee their homes, but little is being reported. The UN High Commissioner for Human Rights said that this is one of the most horrendous human rights situations in the world, with massive use of rape as an instrument of terror and weapon of war, yet it has been more or less off the international radar. There has been uh, profound suffering um, of the civilian population. So the conflict that began in December 2013 has uh, intensified in 2015, particularly in one state, Unity State. There needs to uh, be a commitment to end the violence. And then there needs to be a commitment uh, on accountability, meaningful accountability. The International Committee of the Red Cross is one of the organizations on the ground working to improve the lives of civilians. And they said violence against the population has been horrific. They said the largest problem they are dealing with is hunger, followed by addressing violence towards civilians but also reconnecting families who have been separated as they flee attacks. Check out the ICRC's website or the Killing Fields in the New York Times for more information on the war the world forgot. This is Jeff Walsh, reporting for Peace News.